What if I told you you read the first line wrong? What is up everybody and welcome back to another video. How's your day going so far? Good? Good! Amazing! Very good! Great! Good, I'm glad. So today's video is pretty intense. I'm gonna be going through some of the toughest brain tricks on the internet. I'm actually really excited and looking forward to the challenge because I consider myself really smart. So I'm really wondering if I'm gonna be able to pass these because these were the top 10 hardest brain tricks on the internet. So I'm gonna do my best to pass all of these brain tricks and make you guys very proud. Please do them with me. I would like to see if you guys can pass these as well. But I don't think you can. No, 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 I don't think you can at all. Like I said, I'm a genius. You know, they call me Christian Einstein. Nobody calls you that. Yes, they do. A lot of people call me that. You're just not around when they say it. And what are you doing up there? Don't listen to my video. Damn it. All right, so let's see how I do. Let's start the video. Are the horizontal lines parallel or do they slope? All right, just give me a second. Let me get the brain working here. They're sloped. They're sloped because they're on angles like that. Wait, are they sloped? Okay, if I use my finger and I follow the line. Wait, they're not sloped. Wait, how? Oh God, this is hurting my eyes. Wait, but they clearly look sloped. It doesn't make sense. Okay, I'm gonna go with they're parallel. And the only reason why I say that is because if I use my finger and I run it across and go to the next one and run it across and go to the next one and run it across, they end up being like that. Oh my God. It's because the boxes are like out of order. So it makes your brain think that they're <laughs> one down, nine to go. Let's go. What if I told you, you read the first line wrong? Wait, what? What if I told you, you read the first line wrong? Okay. <laughs> what is it like a trick with like the background, the color? What if I told you, you read the first line wrong. Okay, now you're just messing with me. What is happening here? What it... Oh my god, there's an I. What I if told you, you read the first line wrong. How did I not see that? I thought I was smarter. I thought I was smarter than that. Who read that wrong? Please, don't sit there and lie. I know you guys read that wrong too. If you read that wrong too, comment down below. All right, here we have an image of a guy whose face is cut in half. The image is called Two-Faced. Okay, these things are really messing with me now. There's gotta be like some trick. Does it have to do with his shirt? Cause it's, sh it's like not a straight shot down the middle. It's kind of, it goes into his shirt. He's got his mouth, his nose, is it? Oh my God! Look at his face from this side. Oh my God, I did not see that at all. I didn't even realize that he has a face looking this way. Wow, it's so clear though. I feel like that would have been the first one I would have saw. Failed! I got a big dick. Oh, come on, come on. You read that wrong. That awkward moment when you read that wrong too and said moment after awkward. This is awkward. Wait, hold on a second. <laughs> I got a big dick. You read that wrong. That awkward moment when you read that wrong too and said moment after awkward. Wait, but it's that. Ow, my head hurts. Okay, I really gotta just start paying attention and just reading everything letter for letter to make sure there's nothing wrong here because I missed moment completely. I thought there was moment there. I got a bit. A dick pick! Ah! I didn't even see that either. You read, you that read wrong. Oh my god. All right, I'm I'm just gonna throw that one out. That one just pissed me off. Four perfectly round circles. I mean, they're all intertwined with each other, so that really doesn't make sense. Oh my god, they are actually four perfectly round circles. When I just squinted there, because I was looking at the center, when I just squinted there, it made everything look individual. Try that, because I know if you look dead on, it looks like they're all like, like that, but if you're looking dead on and you squint, you should see the circles individually. Oh my god, this is a trick. I'm freaking out! I'm freaking out! I got a wet pussy. Really? You read that wrong. You read that wrong too. Okay, slowing it down. Here we go. I got a pet wussy. Oh my god. You read that wrong. You that read wrong. You read that wrong too. Please tell me you guys are reading these wrong too. <laughs> I thought they called me Christian Einstein. Is this image moving or is it still? I'm one with the force. The force is with me. I'm one with the force. The force is with me. This picture is moving. Please tell me you guys are seeing this. There's no way that this is a still picture. Like everything is moving. All right, final answer. It's a moving picture. This is a still image. It's moving. I'm watching it move. Please tell me you guys see this moving too. I feel so alone. Can you find the mistake? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Okay, there's gotta be something wrong with the numbers for sure. Does it have to do with the color? Can you find the. Oh my god! They gotta stop messing with me like that. Why do you not see the second the? That's just what's bothering me so much. So there's nothing wrong with the numbers, so I got that right at least. <laughs> There's two freaking thes. That's the mistake. There's two thes. Paris in the spring. Paris in the the spring. Oh, that's freaking coming in. 
Back to back, they thought they were gonna get me. Uh uh, catch me outside. How about that? All right, guys, this is the last one. This is number ten. Can we predict your number? Pick a number, then follow the line to the number on the opposite side. Take those two numbers and subtract the smaller number from the bigger number. Let's do ten to four. Is your number six? Wait, hold on. It is six. How? How did they know that? Pick a number, then follow the line to the opposite. Side, take those two numbers and subtract the smaller number from the bigger number. Okay, I did that. Here's number six. Yes, it is. How? Okay, wait, hold on. What if I take two from eight, six, three from nine, six? Okay. They all equal six. They call me Christian Einstein, okay? Does anybody else's head hurt after that? I feel like that freaking moving picture that did it to me. All right, so I passed. <laughs> I got them all right, eventually, over a period of time. They call me Christian Einstein, okay? Damn! Just let me have that at least. Which one was the hardest one for you guys? I want to know. Comment down below. Which one out of the ten was like the most difficult for you to process? I feel like they were all really di I mean, they were easy for me. <laughs> but like I said earlier, isn't it crazy how the brain doesn't even like acknowledge the second the because it's already reading the sentence in, in your mind? But even though there's like a second the there, clearly it's right there. Your brain just doesn't even process that. It's kind of scary. But that concludes today's video, guys. Thank you so much for watching. Make sure to leave this video a big thumbs up. Yes, go down below and smash that thumbs up button. Let's see if we can get this video to 30,000 likes. Honestly, guys, you guys have been crushing it. Thank you so much for all the likes and all the comments and all the support. I love you guys from the bottom of my heart. I really appreciate it. Today's shout out goes out to Maria. Maria, thank you so much for being a part of the family. Why do you pick the ugliest screenshot of me? Why, Maria? Please help me out here. If you guys didn't see yesterday's video, make sure you check it out. I reacted to cartoon characters in real life. Yes, people that look like cartoon characters in real life. Do you believe that? Make sure to tweet at me at Christian D a screenshot of your favorite part of this video for a chance to get a shout out in my next video. Make sure you guys turn my notifications on. There's a little bell button in the top right corner of my channel guys if you go to my channel click that button You can turn my notifications on there so that you never miss a video. Love you guys, and I'll see you tomorrow. Peace